Hello, friends, family, and my followers. This is Hike360, and I'm here to give you a new hike this week. Woo! Woo -hoo -hoo! Hey, hey, family, friends, followers, it's Hike360 here, and I'm gonna give you a new hike this week. I'm at Kankakee River State Park. Pretty far south. Further south than the Indiana Dunes. But uh, yeah, here I am. I've got like 4.8 miles ahead of me. It is a there and back hike. And this is the trail uh, next to the campgrounds. And I took a look. Uh, the campgrounds seem like, like a really good place to camp. Uh, the, the grass and soil are well kept and it looks comfortable and there's not a lot of dead trees. There's not a lot of trees hanging over the campsites. So that's all really cool. But yeah, this, uh, this hike is going to be following Kankakee River and then it goes to Rock Creek and I go up along Rock Creek for a little bit and then turn around and come back. So I will give you the best views of this hike. So tune in to the following videos. Peace. All right. Absolutely gorgeous out right now. The, uh, the water just looks fantastic. Sun is out. Not a cloud in the sky. This is the Kankakee River. So something mentioned in the book, if you can see it, there are four limestone pillars right along uh, that go through the river over there and that was supposed to be a bridge that uh, did not was not properly funded and they had to just sort of ditch it so these pillars uh, have been left behind and have been there for some time I, I guess That's what an incomplete incomplete bridge looks like. All right, let's keep moving. So I found this absolutely legendary spot right here. It's uh, on these cliffs along the Kankakee River. And I am just chilling. All right, so this is the suspension bridge that goes over Rock Creek. And I will be um, hiking along Rock Creek for maybe half a mile, turning around and then heading back to where I parked. This is pretty cool. This is a fun little bridge. You can see what looks like canyons on the left side here it's in the shadows so I don't know how well the camera's picking it up but canyons reminiscent of Starved Rock and Mathiasen so that's pretty cool to see they're pretty carved out at the bottom too they're really like overhanging into the creek and uh, yeah really cool stuff Okay, I found a way down next to Rock Creek and uh, I wanted to try and show you again this uh, canyon stuff going on across the, across the creek. So down this way is uh, the opening to Kankakee River, 
creek moves up. It's got the suspension bridge again. And then just like some really neat walls happening. Yeah, look at that. Whoa, muddy. Whoa, really muddy. I am at the known highlight of Rock Creek, and I gotta say, I am not disappointed. These cliffs are very fun to be dangerous on. So there is a little waterfall, as promised. And I got a better view. So let me slowly turn around. Very exhilarating over here. Okay. There's the waterfall, beautiful waterfall. Beautiful soundscape. Okay, that does it for me. I just finished the Kankakee River State Park hike. I hiked along the Kankakee River up to Rock Creek and uh, got to the Rock Creek waterfall and turned around. I ran back for at least a mile and a half because the sun is almost down and I didn't want to get caught, uh, you know, behind closed grounds, closed campgrounds. Anyway, so I ran back for a lot of it. And that was interesting. It ended up being 7.19 miles, which is a little bit more than I expected. Uh, but nonetheless, it was really worth it. I had a absolute great time uh, exploring this this area of the state park um, I really really enjoyed the uh, canyon walls that uh, were running alongside the uh, Rock Creek uh, that was super cool I enjoyed going over the suspension bridge um, just all in all it was a it was a great day for hiking um, warm enough warm enough and uh, you know really sunny so I strongly suggest anybody uh, who is looking for a place to hike uh, to, to visit Kankakee River State Park. All right, I'll catch you guys in, uh, in a week with a new hike. Peace.